It is a new dawn and the sense that we are starting afresh. The first game of this brand new Premier League season and it's bound to be compelling. Stay with us here on EA TV for every kick of the ball. And I must say, it's always a very pleasant walk to this venue. Craven Cottage by the banks of the Thames. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it is a day of renewal, the first game of the Premier League season. Always something to look forward to. It's Fulham taking up opportunity and not cleared away properly. Palinha. Well, he was keen to give that one a go. Sadly, lacking a bit of accuracy. Well, he can't believe his side haven't taken the lead there. That was a big chance. What can they do from here? And cuts inside. Oh, it's in! The opening goal of the derby! And listen to what it means! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. It'll be interesting to see whether or not Chelsea can articulate an appropriate reply. Joel Linton. Now look at this, they might be able to cash in here. Sends it back. The clearance wasn't decisive. And teammates to play it to. Joel Linton. And the last touch off the defender, so a corner coming up. Let's see about the delivery. And the problem not completely solved. Can he put it away? And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Can someone get on the end of this? And it's gone in! Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box, and then it's a really clever header. He doesn't try and head it too hard, but just loops it back into the far corner. That's a great finish. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Fofana. Moises Caicedo. Sterling has it. Nkunku. And now Sterling. Marlin, oh to trim back the lead, and a goal, not over just yet. Well it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish, that's a clever goal. So on with the match, 2-1 is the scoreline, what's going to happen next? Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Palinha.
Well, passing moves like this will build confidence. Well, he's got past his man. Brilliantly blocked. And Chelsea have given it away. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Joe Linton. And a goal! They've increased the lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Underway again with the score at 3 1. Daniel Malin. And they need to get tighter. Caicedo. Sterling. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Alcaraz. Is this the moment? And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here it is again. And just look how he creates this chance. That's so inventive. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. This is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Fernandez. Sterling. Caicedo. Di Sassi. Fofana. Enzo Fernandez. Could be. What a commitment to defending. And over it comes. James. Marlon. On to Nkunku. Ah, winning back possession. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Real chance. Well, hey. Looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Marlin. That was perfectly timed, and it is going to be a corner.
Who can he pick out? And the referee's whistle. We're officially at the halfway mark here in West London. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here. Well, I think he's been outstanding so far. He's looked a constant threat and he scored a very good goal. What a player he is. to the second half then and it's not lost on Chelsea that they need to raise their game here Sterling cuts it back he must finish oh incredible save and he snuffed out any sign of danger and in range Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Into the advanced position. This looks promising. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Played over. Appeared to be in two minds. Well, defensive resilience there. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. But nothing comes of it. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, in truth, it could have been more challenging for the goalkeeper. Timing was perfect. Ball one. Getting the better of his opponent. Wonderful block. Well, good run and good ball control. Joan Linton. He fancies it. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Kunku. Tisasi. Here's Chilwell. Marino. Textbook defending inside the box. Being pressed and pressed high. Breaking at pace. Well, it petered out. Well, Arsenal fans, no doubt about it, very excited given the transfer news. They've got their man, Stuart. Yeah, I like the look of him. Oh, Stuart, opportunity here. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply... 
they can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. goal. Number 18, Christopher. 20 minutes to go. Well, it could be on for him here. Just the challenge that was required. Chilwell. It's really opening up positively for Chelsea. So, deflection, and it will be a throw-in. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Played in there, and thumped away. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, he's through here! I don't mind saying that is out of this world. Spectacular. Well, here it is again. And just look how he creates this chance. That's so inventive. But I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. And if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Axel Di Sassi. On to James. Rabiot. And he did well to cut it out. It is a decent looking attack here. And that's really well read. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Fulham versus Luton Town. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Nkunku. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Oh, might be. Determined defending. Mount It's gone in and well he might celebrate on the back of that Well let's look at this again Derek because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and then the shot is emphatic he strikes it with such power the keeper has no time to react what a good finish Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Mikel Marino. Nkunku has it. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. James. Mikel Marino. Rabiot, he must finish, and there it is, a goal, but will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings, they haven't been at the best. Well here's the replay, he's got such quick feet hasn't he, just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away, that's a really good goal. The referee blows for full time, it ends in a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, this was a stern test for them, but I thought they looked a decent side today. They're going to be hard to beat. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Yeah, he was superb, wasn't he? Didn't let his head drop, demanded more of his teammates and probably deserved better for all his effort today.